Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Good morning. Today's video, I am going to be showing you guys my winter morning routine as a mom. I have two little girls and yeah, let's get started. I'm laying down at the compartment. Oh no, I see you only when you're balling. Oh no, I don't even care to die. I see you in a while because this time I will choose you. Yeah. All right, guys, so I'm starting off this morning by waving out my hair a little bit. I'm also adding some earrings. I feel like that just kind of adds a nice little touch to kind of feel more put together, or like more awake. I usually don't do my hair in the mornings typically I just kind of go and go and go but my husband was here this morning to kind of help me out with the girls while I just got this done and then I'm going to head into the living room and just open up the blinds and also turn on the Christmas tree I love turning on the Christmas tree in the mornings and at night because I feel like it just adds such a nice cozy touch I have been doing one load of laundry a day just to kind of keep me on track and not have everything just pile up by the end of the week and it's really helped me out a lot and I did a video on that routine not too long ago so if you guys are interested in checking that out I will make sure to leave that down below. You got that something baby that I can go absolutely love opening up the blinds to let some natural lighting in. I just, I don't know, I really like the way that looks in the mornings. It just kind of like wakes us all up. And I'm also trying to quickly just do Leia's bed as good as I can. Holding a baby, it's pretty hard. But yeah, another thing that I found that's really um, kind of helped um, Amelia be more entertained during the day is just kind of bring out her little play gym into the living room instead of just keeping it in Leia's room. She got kind of bored of that. So I like to pattern it up with a little bit more cushion. Um, and so I just add like a throw blanket because it's a little bit rough on the bottom. So this kind of helps her head a little. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to lay her out here while I drink my coffee really quick, which I have no idea where that clip went. You guys, I was going to show you myself drinking my coffee and I don't know. I don't know what happened in that footage, but I drank my coffee here. Never found somewhere I fit in. Until I met you, I was feeling alone. You're the one who can make it go away Heading back into my bedroom, I am going to make my bed really quick. This is something that I have started doing every single morning, pretty much since I had Amelia. Just something to quickly look more put together, look more fresh and reset. I didn't wash my sheets or anything, but just having the bed made, I just feel like it adds such a nice clean touch to a bedroom, even though, you know, the bed sheets aren't really super, super clean or anything like that. At least the bed is done. And once you're done with your day, you can crawl back into a perfectly made bed. Sometimes I
I do not escape the bottle washing. This is something I do, I think, twice a day. I've, you know, before I was kind of like trying to find my routine, so I would wash bottles as soon as I would see them. But now I just wash them every single morning from the night, like the ones that she used from the night. And then um, I will wash them again before Amelia goes to sleep just to have them ready for the night. And this routine is pretty good. I kind of got used to washing them, so it's all good. I would love to know what is one thing that you guys love to do in the mornings to wake you up? Do you guys like to go exercise? Do you guys stretch? Do you guys have to have coffee? Do you feel like you don't need coffee? I don't know. I feel like everyone has that one thing that's like, yes, I absolutely need my skincare routine or I have to take a shower in the morning or, you know, something like that. Let me know down in the comments below. What is your thing? I'm telling lies That is how we stay alive mm. So you know that I don't mind About what is wrong and what is right We keep moving in different We had actually made our let me rephrase that. We had tried to make a gingerbread home um, the night before this, and I did clean off a lot of the crumbs that falls off, like the hardening of like the frosting and stuff like that, but a lot of it somehow still stayed on the table, so I need to quickly wipe that down and make sure it was nice and clean because that was getting on my nerves. So Brando had helped me out here with making Leia her breakfast this morning, and so I am just going to quickly clean that up. Leia does eat here on this little table. She also does like her Play-Doh on the table. She paints on the table, colors on the table. So I am constantly wiping down this little table. I did get it from Ikea not too long ago and I, I love it. It's a really cute table. I got it for I think like $20 and I just I just love the look of it and she really loves it. Two different minds Telling lies That's how we stay alive So my husband was home, like I said, so this gave me some time to do my makeup. So I'm going to show you guys really quick what my go-to makeup is for like an everyday look. I don't really focus too much on it. I'm not great at makeup, but I'm just going to show you guys what I do. So I'm going to start off with some eyebrow gel to my eyebrows to darken them up. I feel like that's like the first thing I do. If I'm not going to do my makeup, I'm at least going to fill in my eyebrows. And I use a pomade from e.l.f., I think. It's kind of a dupe for the Anastasia. And and I find that it works really, really well and it's way cheaper. I'm going to try to have everything that I used um, linked down below if you guys are interested in checking that out, by the way. I'm going to be using two different foundations. I'm going to be using the Urban Decay All Nighter, I think that's what it's called. And I'm also going to use the Too Faced 2D Fruity um, foundation. These two work really well. I do feel like they are a little bit dark for me since it's winter. My skin obviously isn't as tan during like it is during the summer. So I have been thinking that I have to switch foundations already because I've had these two for like a year and I feel like it's just time to finally get something new for the new year. So if you guys have any great like recommendations for good foundations, let me know down below. I absolutely love this Tarte Shape Tape. If you guys have not tried this Tarte Shape Tape and you guys are looking for a good concealer for those dark eye circles, try this one out. You guys will love it. I always stock up on this stuff. It is amazing. So I'm using this little um, powder from Makeup Revolution. I got this at, I think, Target, and it's just, it's a fairly cheap um, option just to kind of give you that matte look. So I'm just gonna be spreading this all over my face. For bronzer, I'm going to be using the the Balm Bahama Mama, and I think they only have like one shade, but I've been using this for years, you guys, and I love it. It's a little bit dark, so 
So if I'm not using this, you'll find me using the Chocolate Soleil Bronzer by Too Faced. Now I'm taking another palette. This is the eyeshadow palette um, from Makeup Revolution. One of them, I'm not too sure. I think it's Makeup Revolution. I'm not too sure. I need to check that out. I'll make sure <laughs> and I'll leave the right one down below. But I love using this one for my eyeshadow. And I also like using some of the shades for my, um, uh, what's it called? My highlighter. So that's what I'm using here. I'm just using like a like an orangey color for my eyes. And that's it. Super, super simple, super easy. I have been searching for a pretty good mascara and I think like drugstore mascaras are really really good but I have been wanting to try out the Man Eater um, mascara from Tarte. This one's a little bit old but I got my hands on a new one um, during the Black Friday or like the Cyber Monday sale that they had and it was a pretty good deal and I love this mascara. If you guys are in the market for a new mascara, try this one out. Let me know what you guys think. <laughs> that is my winter morning routine as a mom of two little girls you guys thank you so much for watching today's video be sure to be back on monday for another video see you guys then bye guys